Luzon. The scientific name is Medicago sativa. The common names are Kudremazas in Tamil Nadu, Rijka in Northern India and is also known as Alpha Alpha which is an Arabic word. It was originated from Southwest Asia. It is known as Cuna forages. It is a deep root perennial forage legume adapted to a wide range of conditions ranging from tropical to alpine. It is very palatable and nutritious forage legume containing 15 to 20 percent crude protein. The lucerne adds nitrogen to the soil and improves the soil fertility. It is grown for green fodder, hay and silage. The parts of the lucerne crop are root. It is a deep rooted system consisting of main taproot and number of lateral roots that makes the plant drought tolerant. The stem which is erect and the branches arises from the crown. It is 40 to 80 centimeter high. The leaves are trifoliate comprised three smooth slightly toothed oval wedge shaped to pointed leaflet sometimes with white crescent shaped markings. The flowers are purple in color born in clusters up to 4 cm long. It is fertilized by insects especially the bees. The pods are 4 to 5 coils in a spiral with a hard outer surface produced in clusters 1 to 5 seeds per pod. The seeds are kidney shaped small green to yellow to light brown in color. The Indian varieties of Luzon crop are Chetak S 244. It was released by IGFRI in the year 1975. It is a selection from a local material of Maharashtra. It has quick regeneration capacity with resistance to aphids. The yield is 142 tons per hectare of green fodder. Anand 2. It was released by Gujarat Agriculture University in the year 1975. A selection from perennial type lucian grown in the Buj area of Gujarat. The yield is 100 tons per hectare of green fodder. Type 9. It was released in 1978. Perennial lucian cultivar suitable for entire lucian areas of the country. The yield is 80 to 95 tons per hectare. LLC 3. It was released by Punjab Agriculture University in the year 1985. Synthesized from 20 clones selected for fast growth, high yield, downy mildew, resistance from germplasm collected from Gujarat. The yield is 39 tons per hectare of green fodder. Anand 3. It was released by Gujarat Agriculture University in the year 1987. An annual type Suitable for Himachal Pradesh and Gujarat. The yield is 60 to 95 tons per hectare. RL88. It was released by MPKV in the year 1991. Suitable for Maharashtra, Madhya Pradesh and Uttar Pradesh. The yield is 80 to 95 tons per hectare of green fodder. The Tamil Nadu Agriculture University has released two varieties. Co1 and Co2. In Co1, the plant height is about 85 to 90 centimeter, whereas in Co2, the plant height is around 70 to 80 centimeter. The leaf shape of Co1 is smooth, slightly toothed, oval to ovate shaped leaflets, whereas in Co2, the leaf shape is smooth, slightly toothed, and lanceolate shaped. The comparison of the leaf shape of Co1 and Co2. The shape of stipules in Co1 is medium and acuminate, whereas in Co2 the shape of stipule is long acuminate. The flower color in Co1 variety is dark purple and is not found in clusters, whereas in Co2 the flower color is purple and is found in clusters. The stem of Cowan variety when cut in cross section shows hollow but 
the Co2 variety when cut in cross section is rigid and not hollow. The number of leaf axils per stem in Co1 is 7 to 9 but in Co2 it is 9 to 11. The number of stem per crown in Co1 is 10 to 15 and in Co2 it is 15 to 20. The number of pods per stem in Co1 is 10 to 15 and in Co2 it is 18 to 20. The number of seeds per pod in Co1 is 3 to 5 while in Co2 the number of seeds per pod is 4 to 6. The seed color of both Co1 and Co2 varieties are golden yellow and the seed size is around medium bold. The yield of Co1 variety is 103 tons per hectare of green fodder and in Co2 the yield is 130 tons per hectare per year of green fodder. So the Co2 variety gives more yield than the Co1 varieties.